Okay, what is up guys? Um, I just wanted to show you guys my new um, TDCS, that's Transcranial Direct Current Stimulator. Now, this is the Omni Stimulator. I bought the Omni Stimulator simply because it is possibly the cheapest on the market. Um, what this basically does, it's hooked up to some crocodile clips and it's used to transfer a very low amperage uh, through the brain. Um, so you attach these sponges, you soak them in um, a saline solution, typical for um, contact lenses. Once these are soaked, you then use the headband and then place them underneath the headband like that on your forehead and then attach the crocodile clips, the anode and cathode um, to the back of the sponge like that. It clips on better when they're actually soaked. Won't soak them now. Okay, so the reason why we use um, these kind of devices are uh, because there's some evidence suggesting that it increases um, things like neural plasticity um, in the frontal lobe and other areas, improving executive cognitive functioning, memory attention, those kind of things. Um, and it's also has been shown to um, be useful for um, chronic pain. I might attach some of the papers under the video description. But just for this kind of um, very quick demonstration, I just wanted to show you the device, the Omni Stimulator. I wanted to show um, the different range. If you can see there, the, the different types of amperage are start from 0 0.5 milliamps to one milliamp, 1.5 milliamp, and then two milliamps. And you can just set that as you want. Um, so I have a multimeter here as well. I just wanted to confirm that the amperage is in fact correct. So if I turn this on, let's say two milliamps, higher setting, that should be confirmed by the multimeter. The multimeter will check. So it's a, an engineering device that checks the, or an electrician's device. That checks the amperage. And there you have it. So you have a um, an indicator of 1.97. That's equivalent to two milliamps. So it is, it is actually producing the amperage it says on the tin. Um, so anyway, that was a very quick demonstration of what this device does. Very, very simple, just the four main settings. Um, and I'll probably do another video in relation to some of the different types of experiments you can do use with that. Uh, this is not an FDA, so this is, does not have the FDA approval uh, from the States. Um, I am getting a different one which does have the FDA approval which is more usefully applied then for scientific experiments. Um, but I hope that was a, at least a, a nice kind of introduction to what this de device does. And I shall update you more about that in the future. Thank you very much.